to the day. At least it looks pretty out there. Let's check in now with 7 First Alert meteorologist Kevin Jeans, letting us know how long the bitter cold winds are going to last. Yeah, it looks nice. Doesn't feel so nice, but that's yeah. that's usually what it, we get in January, you know, and it's it's been a cold morning. We've had wind chills around zero degrees this morning, and uh, this is the wind chill forecast over the next day and a half. So the rest of today, the wind chill is going to be around 10, 11 degrees. It'll feel like the single digits tonight falling to about zero, and then tomorrow it'll start to climb back to the mid teens for wind chills. We'll have a lighter breeze tomorrow. The wind actually gets lighter this evening, gets much lighter overnight, and then it shifts out of the south tomorrow. So we're a couple of degrees warmer. Also, it's going to be a brighter day tomorrow than today. But the wind forecast when it's this cold out, this is what we like to see. The trend is on the way down and after 10 o'clock, the wind's just going to be light and uh, I think variable overnight into tomorrow morning. And so that's going to help with the wind chills. Won't be quite as uh, bad for the wind chills tomorrow morning but the air temperature is going to be a little lower. Some flurries out there right now. I've had this off and on. We've been looking at this throughout this morning, so just some flurries into the afternoon. Otherwise, more clouds than we'll see the sun out the rest of today. And overnight tonight, eventually the clouds are going to be decreasing uh, overnight. But by 8 p.m., 17 degrees, 15 degrees by 10 o'clock. And then as the clouds clear out, it's going to get really cold. Once the clouds move out, all that cold air sinks down to the surface with light wind attuned. So tomorrow morning, the temperatures going to be between about 5 and 10 degrees, mainly single digits. But again, the wind chill is going to be a little closer to that temperature. So I think the wind chill end up being about the same as the uh, uh, as it was earlier this morning. So I put a low 8 tomorrow, a high of 24, mostly sunny, a bright day. The wind will be out of the south, just picking up 5 to 10 miles per hour in the afternoon. Saturday, a low of 11 in the morning, high of 27. Clouds roll back in. Chance of some flurries or light snow across the thumb and areas to the north. Not expecting accumulations around Metro Detroit, but we could see some snowflakes. And then Sunday, again, some flurries with highs in the mid-20s. So a couple of weak passing storm systems bring us the chance of light snow or flurries Saturday and again Sunday. But our best chance of accumulating snow, at least our next best chance, is going to be Monday. These are the top three snow events that we've had so far this season. And we haven't had any real measurable snow. You got to go back to, to January 1st and 2nd. Well, January 6th, we had 0.1, but the first couple of days, that, that was most of our snow. So right now, we are 5.6 inches below what the average is up to this point in the month. And this is a, a shovel forecast. Next chance that we'd have to shovel yeah, potentially Monday might be a couple of inches from that one. And then it gets colder after that. So temperatures stay below freezing for the next week, maybe the next week and a half. 30 is our warmest day Monday. Come with the chance of snow. Highs back down at just 20 degrees Wednesday. We'll be right back.